Ronald Mugerwa, a resident of Buama, has been missing since 6th January 2020. His wife Sharon Kangume has always been strong until she looked for the name of her spouse on the list and it was missing. <laughs> we have to... We have tried to stay strong, to stay positive, to stay calm, but I think this is the bottom line. The situation was not different with Fred Chijambu's mother, Regina Namukasa, who opted to check the list herself until she burst into tears because her son's name was missing. <laughs> So disappointed and frustrated, Buama residents whose relatives and friends are still missing do not know what to do next. I've been with my husband more than 10 years. I know what he can do, what he can't. He's not a criminal. Mgarana is not a criminal, he has a family. The government must be knowing where our people are because their organizations are the ones who took the, them. Beka Kawoya, Emmanuel Bazira, Victor Makenya, Abdul Rashid Nkinga, who won the Buama Town Council mayor seat, are among the many who are still missing and unaccounted for. Some residents of Buama have also blamed the parliament for not handling the matter with the seriousness it deserves. Here in Kampala, NTV has previously reported on Rashid Kalunda of Weogerere Chirinya, Fred Jingo, also a resident of Weogerere, Sylvester Kalulu, who was abducted from Kasubi New Market, Hassan Biru, who was abducted from his home in Kawala, John Damrida, a spare parts vendor at Chiseka Market, and Michael Semudu, a resident of Masanafu. None of these appeared on the list. Francis Onebe, whose 62-year-old wife Immaculate Onebe male blessing, has been missing for a month, also lost hope after searching for her name on the list. Even if my wife has been tortured, in June she'll be 63 years old, and at old age it takes long to recover. Give her back to me and look after her properly. Patrick Senyondo, NTV.